so today we'll do expansion so before doing this we have to know some of the formula so formula number one a plus b whole square so for formula is a square plus 2ab plus b square or we can call it as we can say it is as a square plus b square plus 2ab so it's very easy to remember also see the trick to remember a square plus 2ab plus b square so how this formula has been derived it's simple it's easy it's because of the expansion now see a plus b whole square so whole square means we have we have to write this two times so a plus b a plus b so first with this a will multiply to this both the number then with this b will multiply this both the a and b so a a into a a square a into b a b plus b into a we'll write actually it's b a but we'll write in alphabetic order that is your a b plus b into b b square so what i'll got the formula say a square a b plus a b i'll get 2 a b plus b square so you can see the formula is matching so by using this formula let us prove some question so question number one 2 x plus 7 y whole square so it's it's in the form of a plus b whole square so 2 x you'll take it as a and 7 by you'll take it as b so what is the formula says a square so since the two terms are there so i am writing it in bracket so 2 x whole square plus 2 what is the formula a b plus b square okay so since again two num two terms are there so i am writing in bracket so 2 square is your 4 x square is your x square plus 2 twos are 4 4 sevens are 28 x y plus 7 square is your 49 y square okay so let's now solve another question now we'll go with second formula so formula number second is your a minus b whole square so before one was plus now it's minus so whenever it is minus it's same formula a square but simple here it will be minus so minus 2ab plus b square so similarly we can prove this formula this way a minus b whole square so everyone you got it that square means you have to write this two times so a minus b a minus b so now a you will multiply to this so a a minus b so similarly minus b so a minus b this side so a into a a square so minus is there so a into b a b minus plus is minus b into a i said you will write in alphabetic order so it will write a b plus b square so a square minus minus is plus so a b plus a b is your 2 a b plus b square so let's prove some questions <coughs> So we have 3x minus 1 by 2x whole square equals to. So this you will take it as a, this you will take it as b. So a minus b whole square. What is formula? a square minus 2ab plus b square. So 3 square is your 9. x square is your x square. Now you can see here this 2 2 will get cancelled. This xx will get cancelled. Now what I will get? 3 1 are 3 plus 1 square is your 1. 2 square is your 4 and x square is your x square so i got the answer now let's go to the next question so you can have this question see so a minus b whole square so you can take this as a and you can take this as b so similarly you can solve this question a square minus 2 a b plus b square so I hope so you can do 1 square is 1, 1 into x is your x, x square, x square, 2 square is your 4 minus, now you can see here this 2 and 2 get cancelled, so 3 ones are 3, x into y, x, y and denominator 2, plus 3 square is your 9, y square is your y square here and 2 square is your 4, so I got this answer also, so similarly you can use the formula and you can expand another sums also, now let's solve another question so it's look like this 3x square y plus 5z i write z this way okay so whole square so if you source that you'll not get confused with two so again this whole thing will be a and this whole thing will be b so again the formula is a square plus 2a b 
plus b square i hope so you all got it this now see so 3 square is your 9 so now you can see x square square so x already x 2 2 is a 4 so y square will be y square on this side 2 3 is a 6 6 5 is a 30 now all we will write in alphabetic order x square y z so x square y z next we have b square so b is your 5 z so 5 square is your 25 and z square is your z square so i got this final answer so here is number three third formula so and it's very important also a plus b plus c whole square so it's easy to remember also so a square plus b square plus c square plus two you know you'll take two at a time a b then a c then b c okay got it so let's see the formula a square plus b square plus c square plus two no taking two at a time a b a c and b c so let's by using this formula let's expand one equation so we have this we have one question so x minus 2y minus z whole square so see we have the formula in plus but we have the question in minus so this we have to change this minus formula we have to change in minus question we have to change in plus so how to change this see so you'll write curly bracket because you'll use curly bracket inside the question so x plus no minus 2y will write in bracket now again plus now that minus it will write in bracket now we have changed that question in plus so now see a plus no this is your this will be your a this whole thing will be your b and this whole thing will be your c okay so a is your x b is your minus 2y and c is your minus z so now we'll put the formula so formula is here so a square plus b square so i said you already so there are two main terms are there so we'll write in bracket and whenever there is minus we'll write in bracket only plus no c square plus 2 no a b plus a c plus next what do you have b c okay so we'll use the formula and we are using the curly bracket since we are using the curly bracket inside okay now x square i got it done so now c plus i'll write it plus minus square is your plus so plus plus into plus plus so now 2 square is your 4 y square is your y square now plus is there minus square minus 2 times that means minus into minus plus so plus into plus plus z square will be z square plus 2 no here is nothing no sign means plus plus into minus minus 2 x y so on this side plus into minus minus x into z x z now see here, plus into minus 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 is your plus now 2 y z so now <coughs> last step now you can see this as it is i'll write x square y 4 y square plus z square now in this we'll multiply this plus into minus minus to do the 4 x y minus now see minus plus is minus 2 nothing is there is 1 2 1 2 x z plus into plus is plus 2 2 is a 4 y z so i got the final answer so this is one of the very important question so similarly here comes another question similarly we'll use that same formula and we'll use this we'll expand this question also so you can see here a plus b plus c but here is minus so i already i said you will change this in plus so 2x plus 3x plus now since it's minus one we'll write in bracket so holy square so i got now what i got here is that so this will take it as a this will take it as b and this will take it as c so we'll use a plus b plus c holy square formula so what does the formula says is that it's your a square plus b square plus c square plus 2 a b plus what is the formula anyone it will be b c 
or you it's AC okay so AC you can write anyway AC then it's your BC so BC so 2 square is your 4 x square is your x square so here is 3 square 9 x square is your x square so now minus square is your plus plus into plus is plus 1 square is your 1 plus now you can see here this x and x will get cancelled so 2 3 is a 6 i got plus into minus is your minus 2 into x into 1 is your 2x plus into minus minus 3 by x now this is your 4x square plus 9 by x square plus 1 plus 2 6 is a 12 minus plus and minus is minus 2 2 is a 4x plus minus minus 2 3 is a 6x so now final answer this same to same this all same so 1 plus 12 is a 13 minus 4x and minus 6 by x so this is my final answer now we have fourth formula is your cube a plus b whole cube so what is the formula says a cube plus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square plus b cube so from here only formula a cube plus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square plus b cube so you have to know this formula so let's solve one question let's expand so the question looks like 2 a plus b whole cube so this whole thing will be you'll take it as a and this whole thing you'll take it as b so a is your 2a and b is your b so what is the formula says a cube so a is my 2a so a cube plus 3a square so a is my 2a so 2a square dot dot means multiply okay b plus next what is formula 3a square a b square so 3 a is my 2a and b square plus b cube since my b is my b only so i am writing b cube now 2 cube 2 cube means 2 into 2 into 2 so 2 into 2 into 2 is your 8 so a cube is your a cube plus 3 dot okay so don't jump we'll do slowly so 2 square is your 4 and this is your a square dot b plus 3 to the 6 a b square plus b cube now we have here 8 a cube 3 4 is a 12 a square b plus 6 a b square plus b cube so this is your final answer so next also same but the formula is minus so a minus b whole cube so formula says a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square minus b cube the formula is same like before one plus only but there is two wherever there is b or b that there will be minus so here is odd b only b is one so it will be minus here is b square even so it will be plus here is b cube it's your odd so it will be minus hope so you are clear so wherever there is odd it's same formula just the sign is different wherever there is b is odd b is one odd so minus b square even so it will be plus b cube is your odd so it will be minus so let's expand one question by using this formula so we have the question 5x minus 3y whole cube so obviously 5x will we'll take it as b a and 3y will take it as b so what the formula says a cube minus 3a square a is my 5x okay so 3a square b b is my 3y plus 3 a is my 5x b square b is my 3y whole square minus b cube so b is my 3y cube so 5 cube means 5 into 5 into 5 5 into 5 is 25 25 into 5 is 125 and x cube minus 3 5 square 5 square is 25 x square so x square this dot you can see it's multiplication sign okay so 3 y as it is plus 3 5 x so 3 square is your 9 and y square is your y square minus as it is 3 cube means 3 into 3 into 3 so 3 is a 9 9 3 is a 27 y cube so now 125 x cube as it is so 3 into 25 so how much it will be 75 75 into 3 is your 225 x square y now here is 3 dot 5 3 
5 is a 15, 15 9 is a 135. So directly you can write alphabetic order x square y. So here I have written y square x. In the next step I have changed x y square. So you can change directly here only. Minus 27 y cube. So I got the final answer. 125x cube minus 225x square y plus 135 so alphabetic order this is also right only up also okay but always we write alphabetic order only so x y square minus 27 y cube okay so hope so you got it